In the aftermath of World War II, as the world was grappling with the consequences of the war, a covert operation known as Operation Paperclip was launched by the United States. This operation aimed to recruit German scientists, engineers, and technicians with valuable expertise, regardless of their involvement in the Nazi regime. Operation Paperclip was born out of a desire to gain an advantage in the escalating Cold War. The United States recognized the importance of scientific knowledge and technological advancements in this new era of global competition. German scientists, who had made significant contributions in fields such as rocketry, aviation, and chemical warfare, were considered valuable assets to be leveraged for strategic advantage. These scientists had been active participants in Nazi programs and had worked under the regime that was responsible for horrific war crimes and human rights violations. However, the U.S. government saw an opportunity to tap into their expertise and sought to bring them to the United States. Under Operation Paperclip, a secret and systematic effort was made to identify and recruit these German specialists. Their past affiliations with the Nazi party were overlooked, and they were given new identities and integrated into American society. Their contributions were deemed critical to advancing American technological capabilities and countering the Soviet Union in the emerging Cold War. Operation Paperclip remained classified for many years, and the true extent of the recruitment efforts only came to light in the following decades. While it achieved its intended goal of acquiring German scientific knowledge, the operation sparked ethical debates and controversies that continue to this day. The recruitment of former Nazi scientists under Operation Paperclip posed significant ethical dilemmas. On one hand, the United States sought to capitalize on the scientific knowledge and expertise of these individuals. On the other hand, they were known participants in a regime responsible for heinous war crimes and human rights violations. The decision to bring these scientists to the United States raised questions about the moral implications of their involvement in Nazi activities. Critics argued that it was a betrayal of justice, as war criminals were given refuge and opportunities in the very country that fought against Nazi atrocities. The ethical dilemma extended beyond mere recruitment. It involved the question of accountability and justice. By providing amnesty to these scientists, were the United States and its allies compromising the principles they claimed to defend? It challenged the notion that those responsible for crimes against humanity should be held accountable for their actions. Protests and public debates erupted, calling for transparency and accountability. Many argued that Operation Paperclip undermined the pursuit of justice and granted immunity to individuals who should have faced trial for their roles in the Nazi regime. Nevertheless, the U.S. government justified the operation by emphasizing the scientific advancements that could be made and the potential military advantage it would provide during the Cold War. They believed that the benefits outweighed the moral and ethical concerns. The legacy of Operation Paperclip continues to generate discussions and debates among historians, scholars, and ethicists. It serves as a reminder of the complex choices made in the pursuit of scientific advancement and national security, raising profound questions about the balance between morality and practicality in the wake of global conflicts. The legacy of Operation Paperclip remains a subject of controversy and debate to this day. While some argue that it allowed the United States to make significant scientific progress and secure a technological edge, others believe it compromised moral principles and undermined accountability for war crimes. Those in favor of Operation Paperclip assert that it facilitated important scientific advancements that contributed to various fields, including aerospace, medicine, and technology. They argue that the knowledge and expertise of these German scientists played a crucial role in pushing the boundaries of innovation, ultimately benefiting society as a whole. However, critics of the operation contend that it symbolizes the prioritization of national interests over justice, human rights, and historical accountability. 
They argue that by providing refuge and employment to former Nazi scientists, the United States undermined the principles it claimed to uphold during the war. The controversy surrounding Operation Paperclip raises profound questions about the ethical dimensions of scientific progress and the compromises made in pursuit of national security. It challenges us to reflect on the delicate balance between the advancement of knowledge and the responsibility to address past injustices. While the operation's immediate impact was significant, its long-term consequences are still being debated. It serves as a cautionary tale, prompting us to critically examine the choices made in history and the implications they have for the present and future. As we reflect on this controversial chapter of history, it prompts us to consider the ethical implications of such operations and to strive for a world where scientific progress is pursued with unwavering commitment to justice and humanity.